Aubrey and I have been partners for a long time, especially partners in prayer. We prayed in our household and made it a focus, and boy, do we have stories to tell, don't Lots we? Lots of stories, Lots. but we won't share right now. <laughs> but the Lord's been faithful all through the years. And we want to invite you to partner with us as we partner with Daughters for Zion on April the 2nd to pray for the peace of Jerusalem. Tell them why. Well, what better way to lead up to our National Day of Prayer on May 2nd than starting off praying for Israel? What, what an exciting thing. I'm so excited. I'm so ready. I wish it were April 2nd right now. <laughs> because she knows that the Bible says when you bless Israel, God blesses you. And he really said that to nations. Then all through the month of April, Aubrey, we're going to have all kinds of prayer conference calls. About 15 minutes each be led by prayer leaders, youth leaders, all kinds of uh, different groups and times during the day. So Over they, different topics, all different. Of all, but all of it about America. All about America. So we're moving all through the month of April to May the 2nd, which is National Day of Prayer. And then we're going to let you have your own prayer group. Oh, you may I don't have a prayer group. Sure you do. Grab a kid, grab a parent, grab a, a spouse, a neighbor, a friend, uh, people at work. Everybody knows America needs prayer. That's right. So we're going to help you get started by partnering with us on April the 2nd. All the information you need is right there on your screen. And we are certainly going to be looking for you.